What's up TPO gang? This is Caleb Andes and today we're talking about the strategy that we used to find this shed. So, yesterday was February 21st when we found this shed. If you guys recall a video we made about uh, four weeks ago, we did the top three tips in finding sheds this year, and one of those was waiting for the right time to go out. Uh, we actually waited till the end of February, February 21st, close enough for me to hit the woods. I hadn't seen any bucks on trail cam for a couple weeks, indicating that most of them were dropped. But we also used uh, another technique that we talked about in the video, um, and that was finding the right location within your property to utilize your time and hunt for the sheds. So we'll skip to the footage, but took the kids out and hit all the hot spots and came back with a few sheds, not the big monsters we were hoping for, but hopefully you take some learning from the experience of finding this guy with a really cool brow tine on him. And you guys can find some success here in the upcoming weeks because right now with the snow melting in our area, it is hot for finding sheds. Boom, baby! Let's see him. Whoa, show him off. Tell me about it. Well, um, so I, I, I was, I, I was here, I was walking down, and then I saw this. It was almost covered up, and I was like, I was so happy. Okay, first one of the day. Check out that gnarly brow. So the place that we found this is actually right up there is our uncut bean field and this is a really heavy trail on the back side of that bean field as you can tell from the sun on my face this is also a south facing hillside so a lot of deer traffic here during the winter south facing hill gets a lot of sun and deer like to hang out on south facing hills so that's why we came to this spot and as a reward we found this up and comer. Look at that gnarly brow. That's awesome. Well, there you have it. Searching the south facing hill slopes on the backside of food is an excellent source for finding sheds as well as some heavily worn trails. Uh, hopefully you guys can use some of this information and get out there and find sheds. And again, more eyes the better. So make sure you get your kids into the outdoors and get them out there. Let's find some bone. Get it out. Let me see it. Spin it around. Tell me about it. What happened? What happened? Um, did... Okay. We were like over there and our shed was like right here. And technically mom found it and I said, Mom, can I have it? And then what happened? Then she gave it to me. Amazing. 